Okay, so let's take a look at some playback options. When you come to your monitor, it will show all the cameras that you have currently on your live view. When you right click, it will either bring you here or it will take you to the password spot where you will have to enter in the password or put in the pattern. So after you get to this screen, towards the top or at the top, you'll see the little sign that says playback. You'll click that. Now, on this left side, you'll see it shows all your cameras. So click which camera you want to look at, and it'll come up on this screen. Now, if you notice, on this bottom, it has this timeline. So you can run through the timeline where it's grayed out. That means there's no saved images. But right here, that tells you the blue that there are some playback that was saved that you can take a look at. Now if you want to view more than one at a time, you just click another one and it will show up right next to it. And now you can view two cameras at the same time. Now if you notice down here, again, this is your timeline, 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock. As you go, um, that's how you can kind of scroll through to find what time that you, you're looking for a specific point. Um, over here on the left, bottom left, this is your calendar days. So if you notice right here, there's a little triangle up in the corner of this day. That means that you actually have recording on that day. So these that don't have it, they have no recordings, but more than likely you'll see at least two, three weeks of um, this little triangle up in the top right of each one of these days to tell you what days you have the recordings for. So you just make sure you're clicked on the right day and then you find you drag this to the timeline to see where what it is you're trying to catch or trying to see and then here's kind of your options as far as viewing it once you find it. So it's currently at one speed if you want to go faster you just click this and it'll double each time. So it goes pretty quick, you want to slow it down, just come back to the one. Now this is if you want to go in reverse, you click that, and now it's going backwards. If you want to speed up the reverse, same thing. Okay, now we're back to forward. So as far as playback goes, that is kind of a quick rundown. If you want, you can click on this clips, clip time, and this will kind of help to, this is just another way to arrange where you're trying to find if you have like a couple hours you're trying to get to and you don't feel like dragging that little screen. Click OK, and you have your clips right here. So it takes you, you can see exactly what's in between them. Once you're done with this and you've seen what you want to see, Come back to Live View, right click, and you're back on the main screen.